Now also, Reina Preciado continues our team coverage here in Douglas, where she spoke to people about what they had to say about the VP's visit. She joins us now with more. Reina, what can you tell us? Yeah, Heidi, so this visit comes amid major criticism for uh, her action at the border or what critics would call non-action working under President Joe Biden. And today's visit happening in Douglas is her first visit to the Arizona border. And I wanted to talk to people living here in Douglas, asking them what they think makes Douglas a good pick for her visit. Now, the Douglas Port of Entry is part of the Tucson sector, which throughout the southern Arizona border, not including Yuma, had the highest number of migrant encounters for the 2024 fiscal year. Now, not all of those encounters came from Douglas, but I did want to ask people living along the border here what they see day to day. To day. Here's two lifelong residents who we spoke to earlier today at the Cochise County Fair with one saying they don't see much going on and another remembering being offered money to bring people across the border in high school. It's a small town. There's not a lot of jobs here and they show you the money and your eyes open, you know, like firsthand. I came to school here and I saw that I was offered that I didn't take it, but my friend sure did. And when they show you the money right outside the school, then you want to take it, you know, and it's just uh, that there needs to be more enforcement at the schools, especially after school, you know. I live pretty close to the border and, you know, you'll see border patrols. I'm sure the border patrols know more, um, but from what as, as a person in town, I don't see any activity where I would be like scared to walk the streets. Now, Vice President Kamala Harris's visit to the border did start by meeting with Border Patrol agents before heading to that private event at Cochise College. And we also know that she was in, she was expected to talk about border security during that event. We'll hear more from that later. But as we know, Arizona is a swing state and with immigration and the border at the top of mind for voters, We'll see how this visit impacts the race to presidency. Reporting from the border in Douglas, Raina Preciado, KGA 9. All right, Raina, thank you very much. Before she made her way to Cochise County, Air Force Two brought Vice President Kamala Harris to the south side a little after 1 o'clock this afternoon. She came into two.